You might know there are a lot of options when it comes to retirement living for seniors, but the choice is often dictated by the type of care they need on a daily basis. Our Kim Fields takes a look at a few of the options in tonight's Life in Balance. First, there's independent living, places like retirement communities. In independent living, you have a community of typically apartment type homes that are fully equipped with kitchens uh, and you have a vibrant community around you. You typically are doing your own cooking, your own cleaning. The second option is assisted living, where doctors can come to your loved ones and aides assist with simple tasks like monitoring blood sugar levels. You need some assistance with um, getting up in the morning and, and your medication reminders. The third option is skilled nursing, where nurses are available around the clock. You come from the hospital after you've had a hip replacement or you've had an pneumonia and you're recovering and it's a place to stay and, and really get, get better and recover with more intensive nursing care. Finally, there's long-term care for people who need help with dressing, feeding and bathing. For someone that may, may have had a stroke and require a feeding tube, for instance. Our expert wanted to share three key pieces of advice when it comes to choosing the right place for your loved ones. First, ask about on-site security. That provides a tremendous amount of comfort. Second, when it comes to cost, there is a huge range. Are you, um, are you more dependent on a monthly um, cash flow where you might benefit more from a monthly fee? Or have you sold your home and do you have this refundable deposit that you can put down into a continuing care type retirement um, community and then be able to pay a lesser amount on a monthly basis? Be very specific about your loved one's needs because that will influence the price tag. Rates go up depending on the size of the place, part of town, and type of assistance mom and dad need. And the number one piece of advice, tour facilities yourself. What does it feel like when you walk through? Is this a place of love and joy? This is going to be your loved one's home. ARP recommends that you consider long-term care insurance. Long-term care insurance covers many of the costs of a nursing home, assisted living, or an in-home care. Expenses that aren't covered by Medicare, however, policies can be expensive. Look for one with flexible options if you can. There's so many options right now for our seniors and